All right, hi Pisces. <clears throat> this is going to be a reading. This is for Pisces placements. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Take what resonates and leave the rest. Be sure to flip and switch the roles, genders, you know. Place yourself where you fit. Okay, Pisces. What do source? What does Pisces placements need to know right now? So we have bad habits. Ooh, drugs, addictions, toxicities. So somebody could be battling with some type of addictions. It could be drug. It could be it could be drugs, drinking, negative thinking, um, overspending. What else? It could be gossip, uh, drama. People could be addicted to drama. What else? Karmic friends. Ooh. Can't fully trust them. Um, tension, secret competition. Keep your friends close and your enemies closer. Who got this? Was it Taurus? I forgot. Taurus or Aries? Hold on. why that's standing out to me but I want to know oh Sagittarius got that <clears throat> Okay, so you are you are somebody you can have Sag in your chart, Moon rising or Venus, or you could be a Sag with Pisces placements, maybe North Node. Okay, or somebody got Sag in their chart. Yeah, somebody has really common friends that could. Some of you guys have a snake in your camp. This could be a friend who in, who uh, tries to encourage bad habits. Okay, somebody here could like to run. Somebody could be a runner. Or, yeah, what else? Love triangle child. Third party, multiple lovers, choices. Okay. Somebody has bad influences around them. Just Or somebody here could be addicted to pills. Like I said, weed, drugs, to just toxicities, toxic lifestyles, mindsets, thought patterns, behaviors, overspending overeating too much sex it, you know with different people especially impersonator wants to be you acts like you dresses like looks like and copies you so somebody here could be trying to impersonate you pisces oh boy or somebody trying to impersonate your person what's bad habits for pisces or this could be you i don't know bad habits Justice in reverse, Libra energy. You or somebody can have Libra in their chart. Somebody could be in denial that they have an addiction to something or someone. What's bad habits? Somebody could be getting into legal trouble for these addictions. What else? The tower, yeah. Aries, Scorpio energy. You or somebody can have Aries or Scorpio in their chart. Yeah. The justice in reverse is like in denial. It's a lack of accountability. Somebody's not taking accountability for their habits. Whatever they are, whether it's drugs, their mindset, their ways, who they're around. Justice in reverse. Eight of Swords. Jupiter and Pisces. I mean, Jupiter. Wow. Jupiter and Gemini. Sorry. Somebody here could be getting locked up. Somebody here could be going to jail. Seven of Wands. This person could already be in jail. Yeah. The Lovers. The Three of Cups. Somebody has a lot of options. <laughs> Seven of Cups. Yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah. Somebody could be going to jail. This could be real jail or spiritual jail. I'm getting real jail, though. Take it how it resonates. Something has completely consumed somebody mentally. And some and if this is not about jail, somebody's in complete denial how something or someone has completely consumed them. The star in reverse. This could be breaking up like homes, family. Somebody here could have a sex addiction even. Star in reverse. Somebody could be sick. Somebody's losing hope, faith, inspiration. Somebody could be really sick, lethargic. They could be tired. Somebody is drained. Ten of Cups in reverse could be a broken home, an unhappy family dynamic. There could be a lot of domestic disturbances, abuse even in this home, especially if there's drugs and stuff. Somebody's not happy. What's the Eight of Swords? Somebody here could be drained. Eight of Swords. The world in reverse. Somebody could have failed the drug test. Somebody here could have, they maybe they were close to getting out, but maybe somebody release date is, or somebody's gonna be held in somewhere longer because they, because of something. The world here, Aquarius, Scorpio, Taurus, uh, Leo energy. So there could be a delay. Somebody is also stuck in some type of cycle because of these bad habits, whatever those may be. World in reverse. What's the world in reverse? There could be delays in travel. Yeah, Ten of Pentacles in reverse. Mercury and Taurus. Somebody may have like a big bond, a big jail bond. Okay, child. There could, mm. You know, some of you guys, Pisces, you could be breaking... You, you could have come from a family of people that have, like, addictions, alcohol, drinking. Well, that's alcohol. Um, drinking, drugs, smoking, sex, overspending, just toxic, toxic behaviors. You could be breaking some type of generational curse. Something has been, like, going around for generations. Somebody here could use, you know, there's the needle, there's the powder... What else? What's the Ten of Pentacles in reverse? Somebody could be filing for bankruptcy. Or somebody's losing a lot of money. A business is going, a family business is going under. Ten of Pentacles in reverse. The hangman here, Pisces. This was a sacrifice. Child. I got that for y'all a, <clears throat> a while ago. Somebody's lying about something. Something with the justice in reverse. Somebody has no integrity. Something was unjust. Something was something is unfair. Okay, I don't know if somebody is a victim of something or they're trying to play victim. The hangman could be like a shift in perspective, a sacrifice. Somebody has to make a big sacrifice. Six of swords in reverse, the knight of swords in reverse. Somebody's going to have to make a big sacrifice. Something is keeping somebody stuck, missing opportunities, not seizing opportunities, keeping them unfocused, distracted, impulsive, reckless, crazy. What's the hangman? Somebody here could even be a bully. What's the hangman? Knight of Swords in reverse. May Taurus, May Gemini energy. Somebody puts other somebody puts other people in harm's way. Somebody just won't take accountability. Like I said, they're always the victim. Somebody is stuck somewhere. Why is the Knight of Swords in reverse? The Ace of Swords. Yeah, clarity and truth. That's the truth.
Somebody here could be like reckless. I don't know. Somebody here could be really aggressive. Somebody could be coming in. Somebody here could be trying to harm somebody, stab somebody. The Knight of Swords has a, a knife in their hand. I don't know. Somebody's trying to, I mean, and there's this Ten of Swords here. These cards are pretty graphic. They could be pretty triggering. Somebody here could have relapsed or somebody is doing something. Somebody could be throwing knives at somebody. Somebody here, they, they get under this influence and they just, they, they get really aggressive and they start like attacking, whether they say with their words, they physically attack. Somebody here is just, what's this tower? Five of swords in reverse. <laughs> That's a criminal. The Knight of Swords in reverse is a criminal. Tower. Yeah, Page of Swords. Somebody here could be not getting help with the hair fall in reverse, Taurus energy. Somebody has no morals, no integrity, no values. You and the, you and these people, this person's values does not align. Somebody could be seeing something that's shocking me or realizing something, okay, or finding something. The page of swords could be someone that's asking questions. Somebody could see something that's really shocking about somebody's behavior or what they're saying. Page of swords. Yeah, page of wands this could be a child for some of you a, a preteen or teenager that could have discovered something in the home or a parents discovered something about a teenager what's this page i mean the pages are upright it's good news so this could be shockingly good news maybe somebody's clearing this out maybe somebody's gonna go to rehab or I don't know. Somebody may have to be somebody may have to be legally committed to do something or go somewhere for help. Page of Wands. Somebody could be the Eight of Cups in reverse. Somebody could be using kids to keep somebody stuck. Like, oh my God, you know, my child can't be around this person. Or you know what I'm saying? Or my child can't go with this person. Three of Swords here. A betrayal. Somebody here could play an instrument with this page of wands. Somebody could write music. Somebody could be really creative. For some of you guys, somebody feels like they write better or create better when they're under some type of influence, drug influence, or drinking or something like that. But Eight of Cups in reverse, Saturn and Pisces, somebody is stuck somewhere. Somebody here could be faking their happiness. Somebody has inner child. Somebody has abandonment issues with those pages there like that. Yeah, Eight of Cups in Reverse. Somebody is stuck somewhere. Yeah, the Death card in Reverse. Somebody could have had a near-death experience. A child could have found somebody like unresponsive, or just they. A child could have found something shocking, or her or saw something shocking. Scorpio energy. You or somebody can have Scorpio in their chart. It was not about kids. I say you guys don't have kids. Um, somebody could be messaging someone and saying something. I feel like somebody here has a hard. Somebody has a. They have a hard time with change. Eight of Cups in reverse. Somebody. Yeah. Somebody's afraid of change with the Death in reverse as well. Somebody just can't walk away from something or someone. Death in reverse. Yeah, high priestess, cancer, Pisces energy. I feel like somebody knows something. They just may not be saying it. Somebody could be withholding information. Somebody, the high priestess knows all the secrets. Somebody knows the tea. Five of cups. Yeah, the devil. Somebody is has a lot of addiction. Somebody's chained to a lot of different things, a lot of different people. Somebody, this could be a lot of soul ties, Capricorn energy. You or somebody can have Capricorn in your chart. Somebody has addictions. Somebody here could be really depressed.
the fool somebody's really reckless they put yeah somebody's reckless they're like a kid somebody's very naive they're gullible page of pentacles in reverse it's something about somebody's inner child something could have happened to somebody as a child what's the high priestess somebody's doing something in secret in excess but it's like they're doing it bit by bit with the pages but it's still too much high priest if that makes sense high priestess It's a lot of family secrets, possibly. High Priestess. Four Wands in reverse. Yeah. This could be something that was found in the home. Somebody's home could be getting raided. Seven of Cups here. Yeah, somebody does something when they're under the influence and they just get carried away. Somebody literally has to, like, hold somebody down, restrain them, tie them down or something like that. When somebody goes out, they drink, they party, they do these, they, they even may have sex. Somebody here could have slept with somebody's friend. Or somebody does too much. When they go out, they drink, they party, they do these drugs or whatever this is, they do too much of it. Somebody does too much. And somebody loses with the seven of cups. Somebody just is, they're so high or they're so drunk. They're so on whatever pill or whatever substance that they can't see straight. Or, you know, something is blurred. Four wands in reverse, Venus and Aries. So this could be secret, family secrets, something about a community of people, unsupportive people. This is for a child that ch children could be being taken from a home because of these drugs. Four of Wands in reverse. This could be a roommate of yours. Yeah, the Temperance in reverse. Sagittarius energy. Somebody can have a Sag, Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus. Somebody overindulges. There could be um, a lot of fighting going on and a, a lot of um, instability, chaos in a home or family dynamic. Somebody here could be living with somebody when they get drunk or high, or or this could just, you know, somebody could just have a really toxic personality. They like to antagonize whoever's in the house. They'll even use kids to do so. Somebody could be trying to get their child to antagonize someone or somebody's child may end up picking up on these bad habits. That could be something that's been found out too, that a child started doing something. Oh boy. Temperance in reverse is something in excess. So yeah, I, I don't know. I mean, it's, let's move on. I, I, it's like I'm gonna be repeating myself. Somebody has put other people in harm's way though. Their kids, if there's kids in the house, other people, or just themselves. Somebody's extremely reckless and aggressive, a bully even, a criminal basically. This Pluto in retrograde child, what's the karmic friends? Can't fully trust them. Tension, secret competition, keep your friends close and your enemies closer. Yeah, this could be There could be a child that calls 911. I don't know. What's karmic friends? Okay, magician just, I, I was trying to put it back. It was like, no, keep me out. Virgo, Gemini energy. Yeah, there's a lot of manipulative friends. There's a snake in the camp. Somebody's a con artist. Somebody's not really your friend. Somebody's an enemy. Somebody could be even doing spell work on you. Somebody could have moved. Somebody could have... Uh, uh, somebody found something out. They didn't say nothing. 
somebody got clarity ace of swords the high priestess somebody got clarity and i feel like somebody could be moving in haste or they're plotting and planning somebody saw something heard something i don't know but the temperance could be in haste it could also be frustration Somebody here could be living with somebody that they don't get along with. It's hard to get along with somebody because they have these addictions. They're an antagonist. Somebody here overdoes something. There's a lack of clarity possibly with this magician, a lack of resources. Some of you guys are still trying to figure out who's who and what's what. What's this karmic friends? Yeah, four swords in reverse, Jupiter and Libra. Something is really messy. Two of Pentacles in reverse. Something has gotten out of hand. There's no structure. There's no organization. I also feel like somebody here is just closed off. They're not adaptable. Somebody, there's more money going out than coming in with this Two of Pentacles in reverse. Something has just gotten out of hand. Something just is too much. Something has gotten too messy. Four swords here. What's this uh, magician in reverse? The Empress in reverse, Taurus, Libra energy. This could be somebody's child's mother or their spouse or their parent or mother or, you know, whatever. Or this could be a mother figure. That's a friend, a sister, a cousin, whoever. This person's in competition with you. They're karmic. Or you guys could have a child with somebody that's very karmic. They're overbearing. This person is doing spell work. They could be trying to do spell work to get pregnant. They're unethical. Somebody's doing something unethical, immoral. And they, somebody's doing too much or something. It's, it's really, it's somebody's addicted to it. whatever somebody's doing, they're addicted to it. Empress in reverse. Somebody here could have been doing shit while they were pregnant. King of Cups in reverse. Cancer Pisces, Scorpio. October, Libra, October, Scorpio. Somebody could drink a lot. So there could be a mother figure that drinks too much. Or this could be a man with mommy issues that does. Somebody's emotionally manipulative. Passive, aggressive. This could be a man or a woman. But when they get on drugs or when they drink or whatever, they take those pills, they get really aggressive. They start playing with sharp objects. They start threatening you, saying stuff. They become antagonistic. Somebody's depressed, they're miserable, they're emotionally unavailable. Yeah, somebody refuses to get help. Three of Pentacles in reverse, King of Cups in reverse. Yeah, Seven of Cups. Somebody's always the Nine of Cups in reverse, Ace of Cups in reverse, Five of Cups. Somebody drinks a lot. Man or woman, somebody drinks a lot. Somebody could be an alcoholic. February Pisces, February Aquarius with this Nine of Cups in reverse. Somebody has a lot of repressed anger, a lot of repressed emotions. A lot of sadness, a lot of grief. Somebody needs to heal their sacral chakra and their heart chakra. Somebody's trying to, somebody's very, again, somebody's a troublemaker. Somebody's very insincere. They're very moody, very wishy-washy. Child, seven of cups. Somebody sees things when they drink or get high or whatever they do. Seven of cups. Somebody is very head in a cloud. Somebody needs help. But they're refusing it. They don't, or they don't, they're in denial. Or they're in denial that somebody needs help. Seven of Cups. Yeah, the King of Pentacles. <laughs> and somebody here, there could be a man that's on the down low. This man could have status. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, April, Taurus, April, Aries. Somebody could have some type of status. King of Pentacles. Somebody could be the star in reverse, Aquarius energy. Somebody's confused. 
I feel like somebody's non-committal. They're emotionally unavailable. They're a provider. They're stable. Loyal and a kind of, but um, but the Eight of Pentacles is non-commitment, and the Hierophant is non-commitment. So I don't. The star in reverse, yeah, somebody. I feel like somebody's not being honest, possibly about their sexuality here. Star in reverse. This could be a man. Yeah, nine of wands in reverse, moon and Sagittarius. Also feel like somebody's a con artist. There could be family secrets. I feel like somebody's trying to get away. Somebody's trying to keep somebody's mouth shut. Somebody could have slept with somebody's family member or somebody did somebody did some or somebody's friend or a friend of the family. Somebody did something really unethical. Somebody did something or in the community or what or the church or whatever the job, whatever the fuck this is. Somebody did something really unethical. I feel like somebody has completely just given up on themselves with the star in reverse. Somebody has lost faith, they lost hope. Somebody's not healing. Somebody's not, somebody keeps repeating the same mistakes over and over. Somebody's not learning. Nine of Wands in reverse. Yeah, Four of Pentacles. Somebody here is just holding on to shit. You could be seeing 444. Capricorn energy. Somebody could be a Capricorn sun. Um, Taurus. Taurus and Leo got 444. So you or somebody involved can have Taurus or Leo in their chart, Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus. Yeah, I feel like somebody's holding on to something. Somebody's trying to control the situation. Somebody could be holding, somebody's holding something. Somebody's, somebody knows the truth about something. Maybe somebody could have did something while they were under the influence. And maybe they just weren't in their right mind, so they don't want to. They don't even want to talk about it. They just rather take it to the grave. But they're not going to be able to. They're not. Somebody's not going to be able to take this to the grave. Four of Swords in reverse. Somebody may even blurt something out while they're under the influence, while they're upset. Yeah, somebody may end up telling the truth about something. Knight of Cups in reverse. Somebody here could be on the down low. Somebody has a lot of one night. Somebody could have a one night stand with somebody. Some some whatever somebody did was unethical. Nine of Cups in reverse. Yeah, Two of Cups. This could yeah. Somebody Venus and Cancer. What's this Two of Cups? Yeah, Three of Cups. Mercury and Cancer. Somebody could have had a somebody had a one night stand with somebody's friend or a family member. They had one too many drinks, one too many pills, one too many blunts. Well, not blunts, one too many something. And somebody is just Somebody is going to keep this. They're going to try to take this to the grave, but they're not going to be able to. Yeah. Somebody did something extremely unethical. And this and this secret is, is becoming too burdensome for somebody to carry. Three of Cups. But I feel like these people knew or one of these people knew who somebody was and they did it anyway. Somebody is lying. Three of Cups. It, whether both people knew or one of these people knew. Three of Cups, Three of Wands. This, yeah, Aries energy. So there could be an Aries involved or somebody at a distance. Somebody could be wanting to reconcile with somebody at a distance. Somebody could be in love with someone that they had, a, I don't know. Or somebody could have tried to treat you like a one night stand, but they fell in love. I don't know. Three of Wands. 
something could be going to the next level. Six of Pentacles, Moon and Taurus, Five of Wands in reverse. I feel like somebody could be paying somebody to shut up. I feel like whoever did this to you, this was a jealous ass bitch, man or woman. Page of Cups in reverse, the Five of Swords in reverse. This is somebody that just can't stand to lose. Somebody, somebody saw you as competition. This could be a, a, a close friend, a close family member, a close whoever. They saw you as competition. And they did this whack shit. Or this is you. Something's going to end up tearing a family or something like that apart. Whether it's because of somebody's addictions or whatever somebody did. Somebody also could have got paid. Somebody could be working with people like overseas or across the states and shit to do spell work. I feel like everybody that was in on something got paid or something was for money. Six of Pentacles. Yeah, two of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah, something has gotten out of hand. If these, if this is, if a friend is acting, if a friend or a family member is acting closed off or weird with you, that's why. Jupiter and Capricorn. Somebody is closed off. Yeah, something with the Six of Pentacles is like sharing. It's, 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 uh, it's almost as if somebody got paid to betray somebody. Two of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah, somebody got a problem. Two of Pentacles in reverse. Page of Cups in reverse. Yeah. Somebody's obsessed with their image. Somebody's not listening. Somebody didn't follow their inner voice. Somebody is jealous. Some something is just something. Somebody was way out of hand, way out of pocket. And this is all. This is all out of spite. Somebody knew what they were doing. What's the four of pentacles? Five of pentacles in reverse. Yeah, Mercury and Taurus. I feel like somebody's trying to save their ass, or they don't want to be left out in the cold by the family, the friends, the community, the church, the, the co-workers, whatever the fuck. Somebody's trying to hold something in to save their ass. Somebody's trying to recover now, possibly. Somebody knows the truth. Yeah, this Queen of Swords is in between this King and Queen of Wands. This Queen of Swords knows what this Queen of Wands is doing or has done. But they're, but somebody's trying to shut somebody up. Somebody's trying to get somebody to be quiet. The Emperor in reverse, yeah. What's love triangle? Third party, multiple lovers, choices. Yeah, King of Swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. January, Capricorn, January, Aquarius. What's love triangle? Yeah, the Emperor in reverse. Aries energy. December Capricorn, December Sag with this Queen of Pentacles. Heavy Capricorn energy. Like somebody, this could be a couple that did something for money, or this is what they do. They pay people to do shit, or I don't know. Somebody has no structure. The emperor in reverse. The two of pen somebody's life is out of balance. Somebody's also getting bad news about something. What's this king of swords here? Yeah, the queen of wands. Aries, Leo, Sag, March, Pisces, March, Aries. Somebody here could be a tattoo artist or can have tattoos. Somebody can have a, a sphinx cat a, or a hairless cat or whatever you want to call them. What's the Queen of Wands? Child, Queen of Wands. Ten of Cups in reverse. March Pisces, March Aries. Somebody knows something. I'm telling you, somebody needs to confess something. 
This Queen of Swords knows everybody's business. Something, somebody's skeletons is coming out the closet. Go watch Taurus's reading because that was something about this family secrets. Somebody knows somebody's family secrets or somebody's trying to get in the way of somebody's family. Somebody is trying to get in between somebody and their family, possibly. Like that. Somebody doesn't want somebody to have no support system. I got that for cancer. Y'all could be seeing 10, 10, 10 of pentacles, 10 of cups in reverse, 10 of cups in reverse. Somebody here could have had a, a out a broke. There could be a broken home. Ten of cups in reverse. The devil. Somebody has toxic and karmic ass friends and family members. Capricorn energy. This could be someone that you have a child with, Pisces, or somebody else. That somebody here is is a narcissist. To say the least. This person can have uh, air and fire in their chart. Earth and fire. Or earth and air in their chart. Maybe water. I don't know. Somebody is. There's a lot of toxicity. Somebody slept with somebody's family member or a friend. Somebody's addictions. And whatever else they got going on. Got the better of them. The devil. Yeah. Something was all for money or. And this is something big. Or a, a co-worker who you thought was your friend. What's this Ace of Pentacles? The Hermit Virgo energy. Even that Virgo in your chart. Yeah, Nine of Pentacles. Somebody did something. I don't know if something was an initiation. Or uh, something was a sacrifice, I guess. I mean, to be part of these cults, you got to compromise your morals. Somebody sold their soul. Somebody's being quiet. Emperor in reverse. Somebody could have went ghost after they got this Ace of Pentacles. Or somebody, something here could be getting investigated. Maybe something happened at a party. What's the Emperor in reverse? Nine of Cups. Jupiter and Pisces, the Six of Wands in reverse, the Seven of Swords. You have a lot of deceptive people. You have a lot of people around you that don't mean you well. Or this is this person. Cross watch and flip and switch it. Somebody here, could, somebody here is trying to copy you, be like you as well. They're they're a hater. They don't really support you. This could be family, friends. I'm seeing coworkers, whoever. There could be hostility going on in a work environment, a home environment. I feel like somebody just thinks about themselves. Somebody didn't think how something could possibly split up somebody's family or how something can ruin somebody's family dynamic. Somebody just, or maybe they did. Somebody scouted out whatever family members or friends that they knew would be in on something for money or for whatever. That's who this person went towards. A lot of people are real fake around you. Six of Wands in reverse to Seven of Swords. A lot of people are wearing masks. Nine of Cups. Yeah, Two of Swords. Somebody severely, somebody, this could be a father figure or somebody that's older than you or whatever, that, a manager, whoever. They don't, what, somebody here is two-faced. Moon and Libra. You could be seeing two, two, two partnerships, choices, decisions. Um, Capricorn, Capricorn, Aquarius. Yeah, Capricorn, Aquarius. They got two, two, two. So if you or somebody has Capricorn or Aquarius in their chart, you may want to go watch them. I also feel like somebody acted like they didn't see something or know, or they, they act like they didn't know who somebody was. Somebody purposely introduced two people together or purposely acting like they were stupid just for pleasure. Two of Swords, the hair was not in reverse. Taurus energy, no morals, no integrity.
Yeah, yeah, four of cups. It's a lot of uh, child. A lot of people are involved. Yeah, a lot of uh, uh, Queen of Pentacles, King of Wands, Queen of Swords, Queen of Cups. Yeah, these people are worried. A lot of people are here. Somebody here could have felt rejected. Uh, something is just not warranted. Something was just unjustifiable. Somebody's going to try to blame it on drugs and say they have a problem. But they won't get help, though. That's the thing. What's the hero fought in reverse? Somebody's, yeah, nine of swords. Mars and Gemini, yeah, now somebody is just... And a regret, I guess. Something is not working, though. Three of Pentacles. I feel like everybody is fighting. Somebody won't be cooperative. They don't want to compromise. But yet they backstabbed and betrayed you. It's crazy. You could be seeing 999. Cancer. Capricorn. Gemini, Libra, Aries, and Sagittarius got 999. What's this Nine of Swords? Not everybody is worried. Nine of Swords. Yeah, Eight of Pentacles in reverse. Somebody's hitting a dead end. Well, somebody's not committal also. Somebody is lazy. Virgo energy. Somebody is unskilled at something. The will of fortune in reverse. Everybody's getting bad karma. Everybody's going to be fighting. Something about Leo season. Will of fortune in reverse. Jupiter energy. Uh, Pisces, Sag. Every, yeah, a lot of bad karma. Justice in reverse. The will of fortune in reverse. Somebody doesn't want to change anyway. Somebody is setting their way. So somebody's trying to play victim like, oh, I was, you know, I got a, a habit or I got an addiction or something's wrong with me no <laughs> somebody just was selfish they were immature they were just they have there somebody has a distorted mindset they have no values no morals no integrity somebody is has been and somebody smiling in somebody's face the whole time. You know what is it? Smiling in my face. All the while they want to take my place. It's, I forgot what song that is. But somebody's been smiling in somebody's face. Whether it's at family functions. Gatherings with friends. Or acquaintances. Work. Whatever. The neighborhood. The, whatever it is. And all the whole while. Child. Who's this hermit? Who's this hermit? Yeah, six of swords in reverse. Somebody, something, stress trouble heading somebody's way. What's the hermit? Yeah, seven of swords. Now somebody's going ghost. They're going quiet. They're going silent. I also felt like somebody here, somebody got duped. Okay, somebody could have, like I said, did something for money. Seven of Swords, uh, Moon in Aquarius. Yeah, now somebody's going ghost. They, they're trying to get out of something, get away from something. Somebody's being quiet. Somebody here could even be being deceptive now. Just a lot of ma people wearing masks. I feel like somebody here is trying to be really resourceful about something. But the Seven of Swords always gets caught. No matter how much they try to disguise themselves, cover up their mess. Somebody here is trying to like get out of Dodge, but it don't matter. Eight of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah, Six of Wands in reverse. Somebody's about to be embarrassed. Yeah, Three of Swords. This truth is going to hurt. When you find out who's what, who's who and what's what, who did what, who did and said what, Saturn and Libra, it's going to hurt. 
I ain't gonna lie. It may even take you guys a while to 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 get over this. I ain't gonna lie. This is this is some. This is beyond fucked up. Somebody here could have also been trying to tarnish your reputation behind the scenes. Somebody's been doing a lot of fucked up shit to you, trying to make you look bad, to maybe even trying to distract you, trying to get you to fail at something, not complete things. Let's get some chakra messages. Unable to express yourself, so. Yeah, worry mind. Now somebody's worried because something's not working. Somebody's a fraud. Six of Wands in reverse is like fake supporters. People that act like they support you, but they really don't. They smile in your face. All the while they want to take your place. Or they want your man or woman or your baby daddy, baby mother, or whatever this is. This could even be a mob of people with bad intentions. Unstable and insecure, yeah. Clearly, somebody is. What else? Clouded judgment, yeah. Somebody's judgment, you know, again, maybe something could have been put into somebody's drink. Maybe they didn't realize until they got, I don't know, until somebody told them or showed them, what else, what else? Feeling insignificant. I just feel like somebody also, could, yeah, conflict and drama. What else? I feel like somebody couldn't take rejection and they did something fucked up. Root chakra. Somebody's root chakra is out of balance. Safety, stability, survival, security. Somebody could have been attacking your root chakra. Somebody didn't want you to have support. They didn't want you to have help. If this person fuck with somebody, with one of your friends or your family members, that will want to make you, that will force you to isolate or, or they think it will. Somebody did something intentionally. They want you to feel unsafe, unstable. They don't want you to feel secure within yourself or your environment. That's why they did this. Or that's why they're trying to do this. Whether this is at work, with family, friends, whatever or even just within yourself, uh, the root chakra, safety, stability, survival, security. These people are power hungry. They're insecure. They're cloud hungry. This is crabs in a barrel too. It's crazy. They're lazy. They don't want to, they don't want to do the inner work or do the work period, but they want something that you have, or they want what they think is coming towards you. Or whatever's part of your destiny. This could be destiny swapping. People just want to, you know, they want to cause opposing forces in your life. The crystals are red, jasper, ruby, and hematite. The element is earth. Archangel Gabriel. It says, I am supported, safe, and secure, and I have a right to be here. Yeah, they don't want you to feel safe. They want you to be par paranoid, worried. They don't want you to trust nobody. I mean, think about it. A family member sleeping, a family member or a close friend sleeping with somebody that you know, your child's mother, father, ex, whatever, you know, spouse or whatever, you know, it would make anybody hard. I mean, karmic ass family members or friends or people that you thought, even if it's coworkers people or neighbors, people or a person you thought you can trust, that will kind of fuck up anybody for a little bit. And that's what they want. Some people are just the some the devil is the some people some people are on assignment by the devil. Feeling fatigued. I don't know, somebody could be feeling tired, drained, inability to give or receive freely. I just feel like everything that somebody does is conditional. These these family members could be very conditional. Conflict and drama. Their love has conditions. It's like, oh, I'll only, you can only be, or this friend group, you can, or this cult, this church, this group, this organization. It's like, oh, you can only be friends, or you can only be cults, or you can only be loved, or protected, or whatever, by us if you do things that go against your morals and your values and your integrity. That's the only way you can receive this. 
somebody like sacrificed themselves overly analytical now somebody's overthinking they're going within somebody here could be worried they're scared something could be coming out that's going to make somebody look really bad or somebody could have been trying to tarnish somebody could have been trying to get negative attention put on you while they were in the background doing this or somebody's trying to just somebody's just trying you guys could be up and you guys could be in the spotlight somebody is trying to tarnish your reputation by associating you with negative things so people don't see you the way they're supposed to see you so you don't get offers so people don't want to collaborate or work with you i'm telling you somebody wants you to lose supporters somebody could be trying to talk about your work lying and deceptive behavior i'm telling you yeah lack of love and compassion these people lack love they lack compassion they don't have no focus unclear and mental fog i feel like somebody knew what they were doing not trusting your own intuition maybe somebody didn't i feel like somebody mm, some of y'all could have been like no they wouldn't do me like that no they did they did worrying about basic needs yeah these are people that would do anything for money or a person fearful and scared yeah guarded because of past hurt suppressing negative emotions suspicious and fearful lack of love and compassion it's like how you betray somebody how you're the backstabber and betrayer but you're the one that doesn't trust nobody and and, no, and they, it'd be those people that don't trust people that are the ones that be backstabbing and betraying people the most because they know how they are but this is your reading, Pisces. Like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.